Ever tried to write a character so complex they'd make a Rubik's Cube blush? Well, you're not alone. Hey, I'm Colin Switalski, and I'm a self-published writer. My books are linked in the description, and I'm here to talk about writing. The path to crafting unforgettable personas is paved with crumpled paper, deleted documents, and the occasional existential crisis. It's the character creation conundrum. Imagine trying to sculpt a masterpiece out of clay, but the clay keeps changing its mind about what it wants to be. One moment it's a heroic knight, the next it's a brooding anti-hero with a mysterious past, and then suddenly it's a quirky sidekick with a knack for comedic timing. Sounds familiar, right? But don't fret, even the likes of J.K. Rowling and George R.R. R. Martin didn't just wake up one day, snap their fingers and poof, there's Harry Potter and Jon Snow ready for action. No, they too had to wrestle with the character creation beast, shaping and molding until they found that perfect balance of complexity and relatability. And let's not forget about our dear friend, consistency. Oh yes, that pesky little detail that makes sure your character doesn't suddenly develop an inexplicable fear of spoons in chapter 17, despite using one to fend off a horde of zombies three chapters earlier. Because let's face it, nothing breaks immersion quicker than a character who can't remember their own backstory. And then there's the ever daunting task of making your character relatable. Sure, it's great to have a character who's a genius, billionaire, playboy, philanthropist, but if your readers can't see a bit of themselves in him, they might as well be reading a car manual for all the emotional connection there, but don't worry. By the end of this video, you'll be creating characters so real, they'll start paying rent. Now let's talk about the infamous Mary Sue. No, not your Aunt Sue who always brings that unidentifiable casserole to family gatherings. We're diving into the realm of fiction where Mary Sue is the term given to characters that are, well, too perfect. They're the ones who can solve every problem, win every heart, and never seem to have a bad hair day. Imagine a character who can play the guitar like Hendrix, speak 12 languages, and also happens to be a black belt in karate. They're as charming as James Bond, as smart as Sherlock, and as humble as Mother Teresa. To top it all off, they're so stunningly beautiful that even the birds stop to admire them. Sounds like someone you'd love to hang out with, right? Well, not exactly. In storytelling, these two perfect characters are often seen as boring and unrealistic. They lack depth, growth, and most importantly, they lack flaws. Flaws make characters relatable and human. They add layers to the story, create conflict, and provide opportunities for character development. So remember, nobody likes a perfect Patty or a flawless Fred. Give your characters some spice, some flaws, some casserole. What's a character without a backstory? A blank page, that's what. Imagine you're at a party and you meet someone who only talks about what they did that day. They ate a sandwich, they walked their dog. Riveting stuff, right? But what if that same person then tells you they once ran with the bulls in Spain, or they spent a year living in an Eskimo village? Suddenly, they're a whole lot more interesting. That's the power of a backstory. A well-crafted backstory can transform a flat, lifeless character into a captivating, multi-layered individual who practically leaps off the page. It's like turning a stick figure into a Renaissance painting. It gives your characters depth, making them more relatable and engaging. And remember, the sky's the limit when it comes to backstories. Maybe your character is secretly a wizard, or they once lived as a pirate on the high seas. So dig deep into their past. Who knows, you might find a secret twin or a hidden treasure or a hidden twin who is a treasure. Character arcs. They're not just for rainbows and storybooks anymore. You see, character arcs are like the secret spice in your grandma's famous chili. They're the unexpected twist in your favorite detective novel, the emotional roller coaster in your go-to tearjerker movie. They are the essence of a character's journey, the heart of their evolution. Imagine if Cinderella never went to the ball, or if Frodo just decided to open an Airbnb in the Shire instead of embarking on that epic quest. Boring, right? That's because without a character arc, your character is just a cardboard cutout, a one-dimensional figure lacking depth and interest. But add a character arc and suddenly they're as real as your next-door neighbor. They have dreams, they face challenges, they grow and change. They become people we can relate to, people we root for, people we remember. A character arc doesn't have to be dramatic or world-changing. It could be as simple as a character learning to trust again after a heartbreak or as complex as a villain's journey to redemption. The key is to make it interesting, to make it relatable, to make it spicy. So when you're crafting your next unforgettable character, think about their arc. What journey will they go on? 
How will they change? What obstacles will they overcome? So make sure your character arc is more than just woke up, found a magic sword, saved the world. Spice it up. All right, folks, we've laughed, we've learned, and now it's time to put it all together. Let's dive in, shall we? Think back to first scene, the character creation conundrum. Remember, creating a character is like baking a cake, minus the mess and the calories. You need the right ingredients in the right proportions. Too much sugar, you've got a toothache. Not enough flour, you've got a puddle. Next, we ventured into the treacherous territory of the Mary Sue. Remember, perfection is boring, and we don't want to put our readers to sleep. Unless, of course, you are writing a bedtime story, in which case, carry on. Then we delved into the magic of backstory. A character's past is like an iceberg. Most of it's hidden under the surface, but it's what gives them depth and keeps them afloat. And who could forget our colorful journey through the rainbow of storytelling? Each story has its unique hue, shading your characters in brilliant ways. So now you're armed with the tools to create dynamic, compelling, and relatable characters. Go forth and let your imagination run wild. Remember to keep it balanced, keep it real, and above all, keep it interesting. So go on. Create characters that jump off the page and into our hearts. But not literally. That sounds like a medical emergency. And remember, if you enjoyed this video, hit that like button. If you want to see more, subscribe to the channel. It's easier than creating a character, I promise.